I think Wayball for, for some companies can be a, a really vital tool. Um, one of the reasons is um, you've just got so many people on it. I mean, it's really, it's just a huge thing in China now. And if you, if you can really harness this for your business, especially for B, B2C businesses, it can be very powerful. Um, a few tips that you might want to think about. Um, there's, there's such thing as a verified account or a V account. And basically you get a little V next to your name. And to get that, you really just have to submit some paperwork. And you're a registered company in China. So if you have the V, people know that, oh, okay, this is the real company account. While some companies, you know, there might be other accounts that are not the real accounts. So uh, people looking at your Weibo are able to differentiate and understand that yours is the real account. That's one thing. Another thing that's very useful is um, you can really use it for research, especially if you're a B2C account. Um, you can type in and see what people are talking about. You can see what, if they're talking about your brand in a positive or negative way and try to get some uh, feedback, basically, and reaction uh, about your brand. So I think it's a great way to do research. So you'll have, you might have your staff. You might be worried that your staff or your colleagues are spending a lot of time online, uh, you know, posting on Weibo or posting on Kai Xingwang during working hours or during lunchtime or something. And uh, I mean, one thing to think about is how can you harness that, actually? Uh, some companies, uh, we help companies form teams of kind of a Weibo team. And, you know, you can have them working on the company account, actually. So you've got a few different people working on the account, posting news or relevant items, uh, which is great. So there's always lots of fresh news on your company account. And that's, that's one positive way you can, you can harness that energy.